Good morning, everyone. I wanted to quickly share about the physical ascension. So most of you are consciously ascending, which means that you are aware that you are ascending, shifting from one frequency to another. But what is happening right now for so many of us is that we are finally physically ascending, which means that the physical body is physically shifting into a higher dimensional state. And this can take some time in terms of linear time. It can take a couple years, 10 years, who knows how long, okay? But the physical body is physically shifting into higher frequencies in order to anchor us into another dimensional field. What happens is that we start to become observant and aware of this physical shift, right? We are awakening, right? We're having these spiritual awakenings and we're starting to open the eyes and feel see, recognize. We are programmed as humans to go unconscious, to be unconscious and to not feel. So every experience you have ever had in every now has been filtered through your body. If those experiences have been uncomfortable, they have created emotions that you didn't like to feel. When that consciousness from that experience moved into your channel, and created the emotion, which is a consciousness, it either moved through the body because you felt it completely through, or it stayed in the body because you didn't like how it felt and you didn't want to feel it. Traumas, pains, um, breakups, I mean, you name it, right? Losing a job, these are all experiences that once they are ingested into the channel, the human channel, and create emotions, which is a consciousness, if we don't like how it feels, it's gonna stay, okay? So these consciousnesses that we never fully felt out of the body are denser than the consciousnesses that we did feel all the way through. Love, joy, peace, right? When you're in love, you don't hold that feeling inside and stuff it somewhere. You feel it completely, right? When you're in joy, when you receive abundance, you feel that consciousness completely. It doesn't get stuck. It's in a higher frequency, it feels better, good, right? In terms of the duality that we live in. Denser consciousnesses are consciousnesses that are in a lower vibration and they don't feel as good. Sadness, pain, grief, anger, rage, uh, jealousy, um, disappointment, depression, anxiety, worry, right? These are all consciousnesses that I call density because they are in the body in a lower vibration than where your physical body is anchored in right now. What is happening in the physical ascension is that these emotions, which I call consciousness and density, these emotions I want you to imagine as a ball or a cloud. They are being pushed up into the surface in order for you to see it so that you can feel it through you, right? Because we never did the first time or the second time or the third time. And the reason these are boiling up is because there is so much light flooding into our body, high frequency light, in order for the physical body to physically shift consciousness into the next dimensional field. That high frequency light stirs up the denser consciousnesses we don't like to feel. And so all of a sudden, here we are walking around in our day, awake now, consciously ascending, and all the shit is coming up. So here's what I want you to do. I want you to see any emotion coming up from within that you don't like feeling, that doesn't feel comfortable. I want you to reframe it. I want you to see it as a cloud of consciousness. Here comes grief, here comes anger, here comes rage. I want you to remember that it is inside of you because there was another now moment where you experienced something that created this. And in that now moment, you weren't ready to experience that emotion. That is okay, nothing wrong with that. It's called being a human. But now that you are courageously, physically ascending, here it comes and this is your opportunity to say, I'm courageous and I'm gonna feel it. I'm gonna feel it because that's how it moves through. That's why you have to be awake when you ascend, right? You have to observe and feel the consciousness, just like you do all the other higher consciousnesses. There is nothing wrong with the amount of times that this consciousness, this ball, grief, sadness, whatever it is, comes up. 
right? It may come up 60 times in order to completely clear. It doesn't matter. What matters is that every time it boils up out of the blue or something triggers it, who knows what, it's coming up to allow you to clear it out. And the reason we are clearing out the density is because we that's how the body is able to anchor completely into the next dimensional field. It can't have all this density. The density literally weighs the body down, literally weighs the body down. This is how consciousness works. It's very simple, right? You don't have to take tons of classes and courses and dive deep into these emotions. You don't have to say why, 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 or where did it come from? You don't need to. Keep it simple. Here comes an emotion I don't like. I don't like it because it doesn't feel good because it's denser, right? I've obviously held this experience, this consciousness in many times before, and I know that right now I am physically ascending. My body is moving me into higher frequencies. All I need to do is feel it, regardless of the judgment I put on it, meaning it doesn't feel good. I don't like this. Can I courageously just feel it as soon as it comes in over and over and over? And then it starts to clear. And you don't judge yourself like, God, it's coming up again. God, it's coming up again. What am I doing wrong? Look at it through the eyes of the higher dimensional light being that you are. This is consciousness that is continuing to need to be broken up as many times as it does based on how many times I felt this and didn't feel it all the way through. Meaning how many times I had experiences that created grief and I never felt the grief completely through. Got it? Does this make sense? I really, really hope so because everything that is coming up from within the physical body is asking you to feel it, to acknowledge it, in order for it to move out of you so that the body can do what it's here to do, which is move you into the next highest dimensional field. The body can't feel for you. You, the conscious human with the ego personality mind, has to feel it has to feel it. What a gift to be able to have this come up over and over and over. So you're not doing anything wrong. This is called the physical ascension. You are going to feel more and more and they're going to be emotions you don't like feeling. That's what this is all about. This phase sucks at times, right? Because it's the density that we never like to feel. So why the hell would we like to feel it now? but we're consciously awakened, ascending beings. And we understand this. So remember that you are so deeply loved. You are so guided, watched, honored, seen from so many different realms. And you're doing this. And every now you're doing it. Take away attachments, take away judgments, take away duality, see everything as pure consciousness, denser or in a higher frequency, serving you in order to move you into the next highest dimension. Okay? Love you. Bye.